Once upon a time, there was a girl named Emily. Emily was very excited because today was a very special day of the year. It was Christmas! And of course, like, no? Not Christmas? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. No, it wasn't Christmas Day, it was. No, Emily was excited because it was a very special day. That was New Year's! It was New Year's Day and... No, not New Year's either? Ah, uh, I know what it was. Emily was excited because today was International Cookie Day. Which, interestingly, for those of you who don't know, is actually on December 7th. <sighs> no, not, not, not Cookie Day either? <sighs> what could it be? Oh, wait a second. Emily was excited because today was a very special day, and that very special day was her birthday! And like any birthday girl, she was having a birthday party! And what kind of birthday party would not be complete without the food and the treats and the snacks and so oh, Let's get right into it! Okay, first up on Emily's birthday party, she had the all-new Lazy Kiwi Soda, which interestingly tastes like a couch kiwi. Next up, we have the Potato Crisps, which are nachos made from p p potato? I'm pretty sure that was a marketing mistake, but hey, these things are selling these days, so don't worry about it. Oh, and there was also the peanut butter. Uh, don't ask me what that is. And of course, since it was a birthday party, there was lots and lots of candy. Lots of candy until it was coming out of people's ears. But the candy was not the highlight of Emily's birthday party. Oh, no, no, no. The highlight of Emily's birthday party was the giant frosted cake. So that everybody can have a try at her birthday cake, Emily got a knife and cut up her cake into delicious pieces so that everybody, from her to all of her guests, could have a try. This was all very good because by the time she was done cutting her cake, there was nothing left. But that was okay because by that time, everybody had gotten their own piece. As Emily took her piece of cake and went to catch up with her friends, her little brother came rushing into the room. Now her little brother is fast. And unfortunately for him, his piece of cake, well, let's just say it was not as fast as he was. And pretty soon, as you might have guessed, it fell down. All of a sudden, Emily felt like she should share her piece of cake with her little brother. Wait, share her piece of cake with her little brother? But, but it was her birthday party, and it was her cake, and this was the only piece that she had. But then Emily thought about it. If she had dropped her cake, she would have liked it if someone else would come over to her and share their piece of cake too. Besides, she remembered how Jesus had shared everything he had with her. With that in mind, Emily knew that she could share too, because Jesus had already given her something to share. With a smile, she walked over to her little brother and offered to share her piece of cake. Her little brother smiled when he saw what his big sister had done, and Emily felt happy inside. Not because she had been able to eat the cake all to herself, but because she had been able to share. <laughs> <laughs>